Thank you, Mr. Speaker. This is a bad bill. Please vote no. Mr. Speaker, one of the things that the people of Washington are frustrated with in our transportation funding and other forms of funding too, but, but I hear a lot about transportation, about, about roads and bridges and, and even some ferries. Um, they're tired of this impression that they have of being nickeled and dimed. The, the middle class families, the working families of Washington have lived through the earlier packages that we've heard discussed here in this, in this conversation. They've seen the gas tax they pay go up and up and up. They've seen the cost to renew their tabs on their vehicles every year go up and up and up. Mr. Speaker, I think that's why we see the people of Washington so often support uh, easy solutions like $30 car tabs. Because they have this feeling that they're working hard, they're struggling to make ends meet, and it's no one thing that gets them but it's this cumulative effect of a nickel and a dime and a nickel and a dime that makes it impossible to, to, to have a, a, even a $900 car, that makes it impossible to live what most of them consider a normal middle-class life. Mr. Speaker, this package, this bill we're considering, this is part of that nickel and diming. We have to stop this, Mr. Speaker. We, we can't do this to the people of Washington who are working so hard to make ends meet, who have suffered through the last two years, many times being laid off from their jobs or, or put on a lower work rotation. We have to do more for them, and this doesn't do it, Mr. Speaker. And lastly, Mr. Speaker, I've got to say, that the way that this policy was conceived, with little input from all sides. If, if the good member could keep the remarks directed at the policy, please proceed. The way the, the, the policy w constructed with little input from all sides makes it vulnerable, makes it vulnerable to the kind of challenges that we've seen in other public policies in the courts lately. So let's put this aside, let's find a more collaborative approach, and let's do better by the working families in Washington. Please vote no.